Hey guys, watching Bulgore's videos, and I just got done watching Dell 304. I'm just gonna call him Dell Dude. Dell Dude's video. Um, his he had a video on a, his favorite mechanical pencils and pen collection. Well, I have a bit more, and I was a, quite a collector of mechanical pens and pencils. I mean, I was the pen king, the pencil pencil guy. I was the you know the the pen guru at school. Um, if anybody in the class needed a pen or pencil, they'd say, hey, Jay, and they'd, they'll stick their hand out, you know, and I'd toss them a pen, and, uh, everybody had a pen, pen or pencil, and it was pretty sweet. But then there'd, there'd be all the, all, always those people that, they, they just thought you were cool just for your stuff. Well, I don't know if cool is the right word, you know, they just, they, they, you know, you know, I'm not saying they thought I was cool, but, you know, they gave you attention because you gave them stuff. And um, there would always be those people that kept it or broke it or gave it away or say it or said, uh-uh, I put it on your desk earlier. I don't have it. Whatever, man. Yeah. But um, here's what's left of my collection. I had a lot more, but this is just what's left of it. Let's start off with this one. Got this from one of my friends. Um, yep. It's cool. It's like mini. Um... We got this one, side FX. It's really awesome. Click. It's got a different grip on it, but it's like more contoured, more grippy, I guess. Twist up eraser, point seven lead. One of my favorite pencils. Well, not one of my favorite favorites, but one of the best ones, better ones. Paper May Extend. I'm gonna like refocus. There we go. Extend. This one's got point seven lead. Sometimes point seven's good. Sometimes point .5 is good. It depends on the pencil and depends what you're doing. Um, I like how this one had a the grip goes down to the tip and it's like the perfect. It's yeah, I can't talk too much on it, but I love the grip on that one. Good contour for writing for long periods of time. This one got like a dollar store or something. Uh, 1.3 lead. Now I'm not much of a fan of bigger lead. The biggest I like is point .7. Point .9 is okay for a little while, but squeaked. It's got a clicker right there. Yep. Grip on the click. Focus. Now, focus or Technicolic sucks. Never get them. They might look cool, but whenever you click it, the low will come out, and then it'll be come out in sections, and they're always broke. Um, yeah, never get a focus or Technicolic. They're the same thing. They're pretty bad. It's got twist up eraser, built in click with the grip, but they suck. This one is a. Espina, E S P I N A, pearly rubber. I think it's .5 lead. I hate the ones with the tiny eraser. Um, the whole thing's a grip though, so that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm not left-handed, just just to point that out. This one is one of my favorites. It's a Dixon Sensmatic. I, I got this at a, a Teen, not Teen Challenge, a Thriftway in a supermarket, and it's really cool. You put the lead in right there. And then whenever you tap right there on the pencil, it, it the lead comes out on its own. This grip I put on there on my own, but I always show these people this pencil, and and then they're like, oh okay, it's just a plain pencil. And then I take this end off, and then they're like, what the heck did you just do? I'm like, oh man, what have you been smoking? I didn't do anything. <laughs> but yeah, it's really cool. I mean, the sad part is the eraser isn't really replaceable, but you just put a eraser cap on the end. There's not that many like that, and that was the first one that was automatic. This one was one of my favorites. This one, the tip has been mysteriously robbed, but it was the same thing. If you tapped on the end, it would advance automatically. Plus, the whole thing's grip, twist up your eraser, 0.5 lead, I believe. It's a TUL, and they sell these at Safeway, and they're not cheap. They're like eight or nine dollars for two of these, and it came with lead and erasers. So they were really awesome. I have another one somewhere, unless it got stolen. But I love this thing. It was perfect in the hand. If you just push down when your lead broke, you know, you write and all of a sudden lead broke, push down, and it advanced automatically. This was probably my, is probably my favorite pencil and pen of all time. Watch this. Alright. So, turn this right here. Pen, pencil. If you write and it breaks, you squeeze like this. I've been through a lot of these. I probably had like three of these ones, only this one is orange. And I had one that was a triple click that was um, pen, pencil, and stylus. 
And these used to be expensive. Like, I remember spending five bucks on these. And a triple click was like eight bucks. It's ridiculous. Here's the uh, E sharp. Um, pretty much E sharp or the E click is that it has a better built in, a better um, mechanical pencil mechanism thing. So when you write and you can push down harder and it won't uh, break on the inside. Pentel make really good pencils. Pentel, Papermate, Bic, they're the best. Here's a Pentel Icy. Little grip, uh, metal point. Pentel um, RSVP, these are really awesome pens. Um, they don't look like much, but they are just as good as any uh, Pilot GT. Here's another RSVP, is a black one. Medium. I don't know what that one was. Oh, um, long. Oh, okay, only four minutes. Don't want to take too long on these. Uh, this one, Papermate Apex. Twist up your eraser. It's not automatic, but. Oh, that's right. With this one, you can click down and go out and click again. It, it takes the, the uh, point away. So you can store it in your pocket and it won't poke you. That was pretty awesome. This one is a Zebra Air, air Rift, and it's got little air pockets they can squeeze, and yeah, it's really cool. Also, it's got a clip goes right there, you can open your clip up. Tiny eraser, it sucks, but whatever. Yep. Pilot G2. This one is another uh, Pentel Icy. I have a lot of these pencils. I used to have like probably 10 or more. I probably have 10 still. This one's pretty cool. It's a Parker something. A little twist up your eraser right there. And the whole half thing's a grip and you can click that and it comes out. 0.5 lead. And uh, when you want to put it away, hit like that and it tucks away the lead. Got a Sharpie fine point in here. What else we got? Here's a Tazorak, some medicine pill thing. So I gotta stay like that far away. Um, here's another RSDP. Only doesn't have anything on it. It's a Pentel something. It's like that. I put that grip on there after market. I put. I got a lot of grips from other people, other pens, pencils, and mix and matched. Effects Store XL. Um, here's a Fui pencil. It's supposed to smell or change color or something. Um, another Pentel IC or whatever it's called, where these pencils, a cheap one dollar digital click, Do dollar store pencils usually suck butt, got a button click, but the light always came out broken, here's a Rightworks or a Bic knockoff, don't really remember using it much, here's a Prime Star, remember Prime Star, it was before Dish or DirecTV, uh, I had a pen cap on right here. I can just find another one. Well, I don't really care. Um, yep, pretty cool. Somebody gave it to me. I can't remember who. Oh, my, my friend Jordan. Jordan, uh, not to tell you the last name so you don't track him down, but my friend Jordan. He collected pencils with me. Uh, Pentel Champ, another one just like that. Um, a Bic. I'm not counting these, by the way. Here's a Papermate Visi Visibility. A Adderall XL, an Adderall pen. Yep. Here's one that uh, was something, oh, something else. I can't remember, but it was scratched off. It's pretty cool. It's got the click and the grip. I was never really a fan of the triangular grip design. But it wasn't that bad to get used to. Twist up your eraser. I think it's 0.5 lead. Uh, RSV another RSVP. These are great pens. Do not underestimate them. 
Another champ. A uh, Scripto Classic 1.1. This is the only 1.1 millimeter lead pencil I've ever seen. And 1.1 is kind of thick. It's like maybe for sketching, maybe. But sketching is really for wooden pencils. Paper Mate Elements. It's got the clickster right there. Grip. How far am I into this? Eight minutes. Alright, let's cut this off right here.